Hey guys, um, today we're going to show you how to download an app from Google Play App Store uh, that's designed for another country. In other words, restricted so that you cannot download in your country. Okay, so um, it's basically uh, a simple example is the uh, I have introduced you to the uh, Google uh, the uh, Freedom app, uh, Freedom Pop, free mobile service. It's available in the U.S. and other countries, uh, and such as U.K. But if you're in in the country that's not supported, for example, Canada, uh, when you go to Google Play Store, you cannot find it. Freedom Pop app. All you see is some kind of a diagnostics, messaging tips. There's no Freedom Pop app uh, populating for you because you're not in the country that's basically it's detecting your IP. It's not allowing you to download that if it's restrict, restricted to that country. So um, what you need to do, uh, you need to full Google Play Store and your phone into thinking that you're in a different country, in, in, in the country that's supported. Okay, so uh, first, first thing you can do, you can Google, in the Google Play Store, find this app called Ola, which is the... Uh, VPN says here Ola free VPN proxy that's completely free and it's a uh, VPN designed to change your IP address using up their proxy to to fool the system into thinking you have a different IP address okay so have that installed it's completely free okay we're going to show you uh, once it's uh, downloaded and installed how to use it but that's not the only thing you need to do okay this alone does not uh, make you eligible for downloading the app you want okay so but let's take a look at the Ola so I have, <coughs> I have downloaded and installed it this is basically the interface for Ola so it's it's quite simple here on the top you need to select which country you want to for example for the freedom pop you probably want US okay so that's the country part then you can s select which app you want the Ola to full into thinking you're in the different country so in this case if you want to download freedom pop app you need to tap the Google Play Store but first we have to uh, because you're if you're in another country obviously you're using the SIM card for another uh, another country and the, the cell phone carrier there so what this Google phone uh, what Android phone does is it actually detects your SIM card lo uh, location first so what you need to do is open the back of your cell phone take out the battery and take out your SIM card okay once you take out your SIM card, put back the battery, reboot your phone. So you have a basically a phone without a SIM card. But you can still use Wi-Fi, right? So you, as long as you have Wi-Fi, the data network will work will be working, but you have no SIM card, so the phone will not know where you are actually. Okay? So let's do this. So let's first power off the phone, then open the back and turn open the back okay so let's power off the phone we can open the back cover Take out the battery, take out the SIM card, so we're putting back the battery and starting the phone.
So the phone is booting up now. <clears throat> so it's booted up. As you can see here, it says no signal, right? Basically, because you have no carrier, no SIM card installed. Um, but you have Wi-Fi connected, I assume, so that you still have data. It's important. If you have no Wi-Fi, then you can't do this. Okay? Uh, so you have Wi-Fi connected, although the Wi-Fi is probably in a country that's not supported, but we can use Ola to fill the Wi-Fi part. That's fine. Uh, what you need to do, go to this your settings, that's the, uh, the gear icon on the top of your phone. Now you just click that. Uh, you go to settings and you go to your application manager depending on what kind of phone you have it may be called app apps or app manager or something like that so basically it shows you all the f apps you have you need to scroll down to find the google app store google play store okay go to google play store uh, here there's two buttons, disable and force stop. Don't disable it. If you disable it, you cannot use it, right? Uh, so you need to first force stop. So this will stop your current Google Play Store. Then you need to go to storage and clear the cache because it's remembering your last location. So you need to clear the cache so it's no longer remembering that. Okay? So <coughs> So that part is done. So basically your Google Play Store is now completely fresh. It doesn't know where you were before. Now we go back to launch the Ola app. <coughs> it's launched and on the top you select the correct country and you click Google Play Store. It says access from US. Then open. It is now opened. Hopefully, it's a fresh IP address. You just select to try to download Freedom Pop. Right? And this time, you see, it's Freedom Pop messaging phone app is populating. Although it's designed for US and UK and other countries, and in Canada here, we can actually have this fully populated. All you have to do is click install, which I already did. Okay. This is basically how you access an app that's not designed for your country, restricted, so that you cannot install from your country. And once it's installed, next time you will you put back your SIM card, disable Ola, um, so your your IP is still your real IP, but you can still see it in your app store. You can still update it. You don't have to do that again. Only the first time when you install it the first time. We need to fool the system into thinking you're in a different country. Okay? Alright, thanks for watching.